Well, this is unsettling. Hello everyone, and let's play games that don't exist yet. Or rather, let's play test The Lady. This is from uh, the Feedback Friday thread, uh, which I participated in, and this team uh, commented on my game, Nothing to Hide, and in return, I would love to do uh, a video playtest, uh, a playtest recording of their game, of their horror game, a horror game, The Lady. And so far, I'm just this completely blind. I have, I have, I've not heard of this game before, and I know nothing about this game. Uh, but looking at the loading screen, this, looking at the title screen, this is already giving me the creeps. I, I, I like this so far. All right, uh, hold on. I'm just gonna quickly turn down the volume because I can't. Yeah, hold on. All right, let's go. The lady. Let, let let's go. Hold up. Okay, space party. Okay. Should have let me click. All right, move left, right, doors. Oh, what? Okay. Shoot right, shoot left, shoot up. Okay, okay. Shoot in. Hmm. I okay. The first thing I want to say, like right now, before I forget, is that it seems weird that boss battles would have their own control scheme. It. it yeah, it just seems weird. Is that um. You know, you would you would think that you know bosses would be a natural extension of the current mechanics, uh, but hey, let's go on. Let's keep moving and see uh, how that actually plays out. All right, let's go. I really like the. Holy Christ! Ah, uh, oh God! Oh, okay, okay. I can move. I can shoot myself. Oh Christ! This is. Uh, this game is created by Mike Rogers. Uh, um, the art. What the hell? Okay, the artist. Is, the artist is Mike Rogers, and the developer is Roger Levy. Um, I'm going to collectively call both of them Roger because I can't remember who's. Um, anyway, um, artist Mike Rogers. This is awesome. This is really creepy, and I love it. Yeah, the the art is. Yeah, the art is amazing. Um, okay, I shoot glass. Or, or rather, I shoot the glass. Okay. Uh. Oh! Oh, why? Uh. Alright. What? Uh, first thing I want to say right now, um, the animation could use a little work. The art is amazing, but the animation itself seems very, uh, what's the word? Choppy? Yeah. Seems very choppy. And also the, the, the blood was kind of freaky, but it was also, um, it, the, the blood particles were a bunch of circles. You know, not as... You could make the blood a lot more awesome the blood particles instead of just circles oh that is creepy I love wait hmm hmm all right I'm just trying to figure out now uh, what to do exactly I'm not sure what these things are. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, I'll keep wandering around. Uh, see what... Alright. Alright, so far I'm st I still... The atmosphere is really... Wait. Okay, that was not there before. These were all not here before. Oh. Okay. 
Okay, I'm still not sure what I'm supposed to do, but that's okay for now because, you know, it's a horror game. It's about the atmosphere, the experience, and being and feeling lost is a legitimate thing to have in a horror game. I, but, you know, past a certain point, uh, becomes less of a cool atmospheric thing and feeling lost just feels frustrating. Uh, I'm not yet frustrated. I'm actually having a little bit of fun. <laughs> but I feel myself uh, soon trying to not know what to do. And then again, this is a demo, so I actually don't know if there's anything uh, beyond this. Hold on, I'm going to quickly check the, uh, the Feedback Friday thread. If there is anything past it. Mm. Alright, the lady is a 2D surreal puzzle horror adventure featuring hand drawn character art and an abrasively haunting soundtrack. The creator and slash dev are inspired by David Lynch, Brothers Quay, etc. I love David Lynch. And yeah, the art and music is really, really spot on. Um, hmm. <coughs> okay, I just read the the thread um, and apparently W opens doors I do not recall this okay first thing about controls and tutorials in general uh, this is notes to the developers they should be presented within the game not before the game not in some hidden menu but inside the game itself because yeah, because I I have no I had no idea that W could open doors, and if you said so in the introduction screen, I uh, I already forgot, and you can't quite blame me for forgetting everything after seeing this lady's wonderful pretty face. What? Oh, what? Okay. Oh God! I don't think I can go. I think I'm gonna bleed if I touch that. Right? Yep. Yep. Uh, yep, yeah, yeah, okay. That was my fault. I want. I wonder if I have like a health bar or something? A health meter? Wait. Uh, uh. Can I shoot you? It bounces back and hits me. Right? Yeah, yeah, it does. Thank you, Glass, for doing that. Can I duck? No. Yeah, okay. Hmm. Wait, what? Oh, hey. Psst. Okay, hmm. Wait, are you fading away? Okay. Okay, so Hmm All right as far as I can tell there's no penalty to getting hit other than bleeding out a little bit Hmm Again atmosphere and the art really awesome great job Circles for blood, you know, could use something else, but uh, I'm not complaining. Well, I am complaining, but no, I'm not complaining. It's a critique. It's a critique. All right, now to figure out what else to do. Huh. Oh, you almost got me there. You almost got me there. Okay, I have no idea what to do now. Hmm. Alright, I'm gonna quickly zip back to the thread, see if there's something else I'm missing. Uh. Okay, so... As... 
far as... Okay, so there is a boss battle. There is a boss battle. Uh, so that implies that there is something past this level with the barbed wire. Or rather, now that the barbed wire is gone... Uh, what do I do? Oh, how long were you there? No, you... Ah, uh, whatever. Oh, God! Uh... Uh... Hey! Hey, friend! How... How's it going, friends? I... Uh, okay. Okay. Again, this... Alright. The creepiness and atmosphere of this just kicked up like 10 bajillion notches. This this level is something else. What? Is this the boss battle? Probably. Oh. Hey. What? Oh god, why are they all falling down? Why are you all falling down? Wait, shoot at boss? Space to shoot at boss. Nope, that's a lie. That is a lie. Can I kill you? Oh. I'm sorry, friend. I'm s I'm not I'm not sorry at all. Wait, are there two of you? Whoa! Oh, okay. Wait, what? No, I just got you. Okay, I have no idea if this is actually doing anything. Alright, but this seems to be the end of the... Oh, oh, okay. I got you. You're down. You're down. Again, animation's kind of choppy. But... But yeah, I can deal with that. <laughs> but yeah, if you'd like... Uh, I I'm also an animator myself, so if you took the... If, so it, like, you know, like you don't need to hand frame animate every single frame. Like I, I can see, like I see up there that the head is actually a separate drawing uh, from the rest of the body. So if you can do that, then it's not going to be, it shouldn't be much of a, well, uh, extra problem to, you know, tween the head and the body moving separately. You know, to make it seem smoother. Because the choppiness doesn't look. The choppiness is not creepy. It just looks, uh, I guess, kind of unfinished and or uh, lazy. So yeah, having some animation, uh, like, s like, yeah, smooth movements. Not well, not that smooth. It is. Whoa! What happened to her eyes back there? All right, get some. Okay, time for another door hunt. Oh, actually, it's right there. Okay. Oh, oh, I'm sad now. My lady is sad, and 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 incredibly slow. Oh, whoa, what? Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. That is not supposed to... Oh, God. Uh...
glass just keeps falling. I I guess there's not much strategy other than just hitting this head. Yeah. Again, the art is fantastic. The background is like everything in this frame right now looks amazing. Except for that green circle-y blood. That's like like I said, it's right. Still. Nice. Okay, I think I think I got it. Oh. Alright, and that is the lady uh, coming for PC in the summer of 2014. And yes, created by Rogers and Roger. Yeah. Alright, you can follow the lady on Twitter. And that is the lady. Alright, so. Alright, and now this is where I summarize uh, my, my running thoughts, critiques, comments. Um, the Okay, first off, the art is. Amazing, like great job, uh, Mike Rogers. That the, the art is really uh, well done. Um, the animation though could use work. Uh, I I can I see that the head and the body are separate uh, images, so uh, it will take some extra programming work to you know tween them uh, between. Well, actually no. If you have animation software, you could also just export out a sprite sheet. So yeah, just having uh, more animation because the choppiness isn't creepy. It just looks uh, unfinished. Yeah, and if you do animate it, that way you can add more, uh, you know, creepy body motions. Cause like, like uh, her like swaying back and forth, and then like twitching suddenly, or something like that. Yeah, having more animations would definitely be great. Uh, also, the I, I'm, I'm, I assume you're gonna be working on the blood, cause right now it's just a bunch of circles. Uh, <laughs> yeah, fix that blood. Make it. I, I, I don't know what shape, but uh, droplets or splatters or something. Oh, that would be cool if like, yeah, if whenever you get hit, blood splatters stay in the background. They, they're forever persistent. All right. And also the audio is pretty good. I like it. All right. So that's art and audio and aesthetic. You got the aesthetic down pretty well, uh, really well. Uh, my favorite level was the level of all the other giant uh, l ladies, I guess, just wandering around. And I'm the monster walking around and just shooting myself at them. That was well done. Okay, so art and aesthetic, really well done. And here comes the big critique. Uh, I know you were trying to go for a feeling of, conf like an a feeling of confusion in the game, but there's, Instead of feeling confused, it was a little bit more frustrating. Uh, rather, if, if you want confusion, uh, look at a game like um, Antichamber or something like that. Uh, yeah, Antichamber does confusion really, really well. And it's in Antichamber, the confusing parts are deliberate. So you know that the game is deliberately confusing you. Uh, here it feels that it's, the game is just being obscure and it's not really deliberately doing anything it's just uh hold on my my friends are talking 